Hey everyone, welcome to Research TV. It's another beautiful day, another beautiful Wednesday, another day for you to relax and listen to me as I give you the latest gist, latest story right here on the news. First on the news, LeBron James has become the NBA's all-time highest goal scorer with 38,388 points. The superstar who took 160 games lesser to break the record set by Abdul Jabbar is regarded as one of the greatest in the game. LeBron James has motivated a lot of kids in America and around the world to chase their dreams in basketball and we congratulate him as he achieves this milestone. Let's hear what people had to say in the comments at Alders. Oh, oh, one said, mad to see the all-time NBA scoring records broken for myself. A record that stood for 38 years, but how long will it take for it to be broken again? At Blue Footy said, the first NBA draft I sat down to watch was the year James was drafted as the first pick and Anthony as the second. I didn't know I just witnessed, I just witnessed greatness in the making. Yes, he has been the biggest, oh, one of the biggest, arguably, because some people would think Michael Jordan is better and they will have points. At I am Tommy said, started following the NBA in 2013. Amazing to think I only caught the second half of this guy's greatness. A privilege to watch. Next on the news, singer Pote Boo has come out to tell us why he always fights online. According to the singer, it's because he's avoiding people from ripping him. In other words, he's avoiding people from cheating him. Pote Boo has been a character since he broke into the music scene a while back and he has been giving us a mixture of laughs and anger and everything and we cannot deny we enjoy him in this scene let's hear what nigerians have to say in the comment section at once upon an introvert said like play like play portable has captured our heart it is true he has captured our heart at black queen said who go help you no go stress you <laughs> and i am right said you gotta love portable and it's true you gotta love the guy the guy is a very big character a very interesting character at that Last on the news, Ghanaian footballer Atsu, who plays for Turkish club Hataya Spor, was said to be missing following the earthquake that devastated Turkey and Syria. The footballer was found alive in a rubble with injuries to his legs and difficulty in breathing. Let's hear what Nigerians have to say about this. At Omo Preshwik said, Thank goodness, may God be praised. At Aizni said, May the soul of the departed rest in peace. And I am mentor people into text said, God is great. Thank God is alive. May the Lord bring the rest of those affected out of life too. And those that have gone, God please grant them paradise. We we send our condolences to people in Turkey, people that had lo- that has loved, that has lost loved ones, people that have lost a lot of properties, people that have lost their livelihood. We send our prayers to you and we are praying for you. That's it on the news today. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell. Don't also forget to catch me here on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays as I keep giving you the latest gist around Niger and some part of the world. I remain your host, Tricks.